In the previous video, we created a couple of pop-ups. They're dead, dead simple to do. Please watch the video if you're not familiar with how to do pop-ups. You know how it works. You click an icon or a button and this opens up. And you can do this with headlines and other items as well, anywhere where you can have a link. But what if you want to enable a pop-up this time to be on a text editor? So let me just go over here and let me type in text editor. It was already there. Why did I type it? I could have just dragged it over. And I'm just going to copy and paste a bit of text like that. And if we go over here, I'm going to put onto this one here, I'm going to make this word be a bold. Um, I'm going to make it be an underline and italic as well, just so you can, ah, let's not do italic, so you can stand out. What if you want that now to open a pop-up, basically? Now, when you click link, you can go in and paste a URL, but you also have link options. Now, I'm just showing you, this is not the solution, by the way. Okay, you can put in a link, you can say open it in a new tab, so when you click it, it opens in a new tab rather than replace the one you're on. But you can, you have loads of these like um, different products and stuff like that. So you might say, oh, take me to this specific product, which is not what we want. Let's just delete that. Okay, get rid of that, get rid of that, like that. What we actually want is for it to open a pop-up. Now, the function is not there, and the pop-up I want is called pop1. And if I do that, it is not going to be found. So how do you enable a bit of text when you click it to actually open a specific pop-up? Quite simple, really. So if we go over to preview here right now, we know that this opens the pop-up, okay? And the close button appears after three seconds based on the settings. What I'm going to do is go back over here and I'm going to right click on, doesn't matter if it's the button or the icon, they're the same pop-up basically. So let's just go here. And if I now click copy link, okay, that is going to give me the link for the pop-up. Okay, let me do that again. Right click over it and I do copy link, okay? Now if we go over to this page, just to show you what it looks like, I'm going to drop in another text editor below and I'm going to now paste the link. I've just moved it above there so you can see it a little bit easier. Can you see here we have this massive long address? What we need is a part of that to stick into our text editor. And the part you need is after or before hashtag elemental. So we want to take the hashtag and we want to take all of that elemental. So hashtag elemental, take the hashtag and take the elemental bit. Let's copy that. But let me do it properly again. Let's copy that text there. I'm now going to go back over to my text editor. Go back to the word that I want to use to open the pop-up. Go to link. And here, I'm going to paste what I just copied. So if I do that now, and if I go back to the beginning, it is hashtag elemental. Let's now update that. Oh, by the way, don't forget. Yeah, I did it probably a bit too quick there. Don't forget to click the apply bit, okay? If you don't click apply, it doesn't work, okay? Because it won't have applied it. So make sure you've applied that. Go back to our preview page over here. And can you now see? Obviously, mess around with your link colors and how you're going to have it look. But if I now click on that, it will open the pop-up. So you could now have a bunch of text and it might say um, download a copy of this maybe or subscribe or whatever. You might have a bit of text. And when they click on certain words, it opens different pop-ups. I hope you like, subscribe, share and follow. I'm Imran Sadiq, Web Squadron, and I'll see you. Never break, always fight, never quit, do it right, play the game, win it life, have no shame, there's no time, feel the pain, let the grind, I could change, in my mind, pick a lane, commit and climb, the only way, to win it life, I never miss that fact, taking big swings, bitch, hand me the back.